the salt and pepper shakers. <gasps> Could we be so lucky for them to be like prices that we can get? friends and welcome to my channel today I am in Bowling Green Kentucky we are at the Vet City Antique Mall which is coincidentally right next to the Vet Corvette Museum right Corvette the Corvette factory too so we are we've never been in here before the Vet City Antique Mall let's go oh look that's a nice big coffee mug mark look at that so um, here we have this booth here is 50% off unless it's marked in D. Oh, this is pretty. This is in D, but I love the colors on that. It's New Orleans. It's $9, which is not a bad price at all. I love that spring color. I don't know. My gosh, look at these salt and pepper shakers. You want some salt? You could reach over the table and salt everybody's stuff so you know oh look at this we're always looking for the weird odd and wonderful this is different that's eight dollars oh see this is where you have to be very careful just because you see something that you like oh look at this beautiful art glass face they're modern made in china so just just know when i kind of felt picked it up i kind of thought hmm feels has a f different weight to it but just no little daisy and buttons for $24 a little compote there oh my goodness look at these little goobers smoking their pipes little owls sold as a set for four dollars they're so fun I have so many salt and pepper shakers, so I'm trying to stick to just buying, like, I mean, you don't see those every day, but I'm trying to just stick with ones that I just feel in my soul. And I like those, but I'm not feeling them in my soul. These are new. I will tell you, first of all, the decal gives it away. The lid, very, very not used new, and it just has a different feel. So... Those are reproductions too. They're still nice for yeah, if you want to use them. But just if you're looking for, if you're out and you're you're really wanting a vintage set, just kind of look into it a little bit more. These rocker cans. This first of all has a lot of really cool, you know, kind of guy stuff. We had one of those Anarcho cans in our shop, but this one's just great with this graphic on it. But yeah, you can see they are. That's that's that's. That's what they go for, but there are diehard gas and oil collectors out there that will pay that much for an oil can, believe it or not. Mark told me I needed to come over here. <gasps> look at the whole full family. Oh, these are nice too. These are 185. Those look like, those are great. So 30% off items over $10 and one cent. I think this is probably locked, but Look at the little baby. Look at those two little babies sharing a towel. That one's cold and crying. I do like the Ross Bro little yellow bunny. I have her. I think she's supposed to have glasses. You can see she has little holes in her head. On the sides of her head, she's supposed to have glasses on. We got this yeah, has glass. Yeah. This doesn't. So this one is everything is 25% off, but I see I love these figural juicers. He's got a lots of little chippies. I'll have you give me a hand. He's 23, but 25% off. He is a cutie. I'm not going to get him because of all the damage that he has, but oh my gosh. Ooh. This little snowman is not happy about being a snowman. I wish it would. He wants to be in Florida. He's 29. He is vintage, but he is not happy. Oh, here's a dream pet horse. Look at him go, or her go. Her little straw hat for $22. They're going up in price. It has its original sticker as well. This is cute too. This little xylophone toy. 
lithograph. It's made in the USA, but I love the little Scotty logo on it. Look at this sweater! Oh my goodness! That is adorable! Aww! That's so sweet. It's $17. What a little... He feels like he swayed, too. Oh my! <laughs> well, that is charming. It is twelve ninety nine. <laughs> Does it, it go night night now? <laughs> That's pretty funny. Good eye, Mark. He knows what I like. Now, Mark, if you got me for that that for Christmas, I'd be happy. Okay. I'm easy to please. Pick up sticks. Bye, Whitman. A girl's place is at the mall. The antique mall, that is. I don't want to be at the mall mall. I'd rather be in the dentist chair than go to the retail mall. Yuck. Ooh, look at the... Oh, look at the graphics on that. I think it's just a music book. Which isn't very exciting on the inside. Which they want, but I love that. Five seventy-five. Mm, copyright nineteen thirty. Yep, that's that nineteen thirties green that I love. I'm not gonna get it, but wow! See, I mean, look, you just lay it on a display, and who cares what's on the inside of the book? I like the outside of the book. Well, look at you, little baby. Look at you on your little purple leaf. For $5.99? Well, my goodness, you're going to go home with us, little fella. Boop, boop. All right, weird, wacky, and fun is what I keep in my mind when I'm trying to find things. But this, uh, um, they're monks, and they're putting, they're, they're decorating their Christmas tree. First of all, I love the color, but I don't know if anybody would want that. <laughs> But it's $12. Let's see, it says it's mid-century hand-painted vase. I don't know. I, I don't think I'm going to get that, but I'm going to get this for sure. And we've got some sheet music. What will we do on a Saturday night when the town goes dry? Well, I don't know. Or then you can go over here and get just a little drink. Here we have a little yellow dog planter. But I'm curious. I'm curious. I'm going to test something out and see if my curiosity is going to be right or wrong. But will you hold my glasses? Oh, maybe I should not. Maybe I should put them like that. I mean, he has like these little, this little divot here. So I think he could hold your glasses. I just thought he had like the shape of his head. I thought maybe he could be used for something. He's $8.99, but I'm going to get him. He's yellow. He's great for this time of year. He's a little hound dog. So we're going to get this little guy. The house may be wee, but the welcome is big. Oh, that's so sweet. I like that. Let's see if this glows. I'm going to say no. Yeah. Woo chi woo. A Rucci boo. These are salt and pepper shakers. <laughs> Look. They're huge. But my goodness, for summer, I think that they would be fun. I think I might have to get those. And here we've got Donald Duck. For twelve ninety nine, Donald Duck platter, which I love Donald Duck. He's very grumpy. I like that about him got some little girls down here. Oh, she's a bell. I don't do bells. Bells don't, they don't, I mean, I like to ring big bells. So I wanted to see this picture here too. That is pretty for spring. England for $6.99. I'm going to get that. I love this crazing in it. You can see because it was used. Somebody had used this. They filled it with water and they used it. And I love it. I think it's great for spring. So I'm going to get that. Funny because Mark, Mark parked the cart right here because he knew. <laughs> He's like, oh, 
Oh my gosh. Okay, this is $27.50. It's great though. The little deer in the mailbox. Let's see how much these guys are. $30. Yeah, which is retail. It's not. It's, that's, that's a fair price. But for resale, I can't. There's not much I can do. As far as that goes, I love these guys. I do have quite a collection of those. So I don't necessarily need any more. But yeah, those are not, those are fair prices. That's, that's what they go for. Here's a beautiful piece, what I think might be North. This is Fenton. No discount. $25. That's a good price. It was $65. Um, I mean, oh no, it's got a boober. It's got a boober right there. I was thinking about it, but I can't do it with the boober. <gasps> what in tarnation is that? No. I just wanted to show you here because you can see you know, we sell a lot of these glass flower frogs. You can see a lot of people will use them to display some fun marbles. So that's just another way that you can use the flower frogs that you buy. All right, here's a couple items right here. This is a Relpo planter. Um, I'm going to have to find out. It's $20 and it says 20% off. So it says look for a markdown. So she's great. I think that she would be great for St. Patrick's Day. She still has her eyelashes. And then this uh, peacock planter. It says it's $22, but it's 50% off, so um, I can't really film while there's music going because the music's so loud over here, but I thought maybe while there was a commercial, I could film a little bit more and see what else we can find, um, if anything. These are no discount, so those would be $8 each there. So let's see what else we can find. I think the music's getting ready to start up again, so I may have to not or just continuously talk which i can do but i don't know so let's see let's just let me look around here and if i find anything else then i'll pop back on i didn't find anything else in that booth but let's go ahead and let's take a look in this here booth and see if we can find anything all right we still have to talk a little bit much or kind of continuously because of the music but um just don't look for or, oh wow look at this epern over here oh it's such a beautiful collar too this is fenton and epern with three horns 150 dollars but oh my gosh it's this beautiful sea foamy collar well that's lovely wish that was on sale it's not but that's well worth the price but not for resale it's more good price if you're buying it to keep it all right so this is from house of hatton it's vintage but it's a mama with her little baby she carries in her back it's five dollars with 25 percent off so it's so cute and kitschy and fun and i like polka dotted animals so we're gonna get her today okay so up there is a my size barbie from the 80s she's 95 dollars do you remember the commercial where you could like dance with her and stuff from the 80s? I always wanted her. I never got her, but I always wanted her. But I was looking at this, the dunce game, and it's it's $20, but it has these little, I'll show you the inside. Let's play dunce. They're like little plastic, little goobers, but they're kind of fun. Hell yeah, this is a neat booth. It's got a lot of um you know old toys and stuff the miss piggy card game the very fashionable miss piggy card game are the cards fun to look at no they're not it's eight dollars it's kind of fun there's a squeaky noise i'm sorry we're right next to like a heater love is bringing her be breakfast in bed Taking turn in the kitchen occasionally. That's right, mister. You're a good husband or boyfriend. Okay, we've got some lunch boxes. Fred Flintstone. These little these little goober guys here. I think are bootleg Disney. Um peanuts. It's just fun to look at. California raisins. What was this one? Little red riding hood. $62, no thermos. 
Look at the left and Miss Pig and Mr. Pig. They're $20 each, the little banks. They, I think they both have their stoppers. They're adorable. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So cute. One other thing I'm going to get too is this little Avon fragrance pin for $3. Do y'all remember these? I've sold all the ones that I have. But this is where the fragrance is missing from this one, unfortunately. But I like the pink on it, so we will get that for $3. Ooh, this is beautiful. This paperweight. This green glass paperweight for $19.99. It's so simple, but it's so pretty. Well, this is a great way to display this. this they've have, they have this acrylic, someone's probably made it, an acrylic case. Well, that's the first time I've seen that, and that is beautiful. That is beautiful. Oh, I did show you. I did get, I also got some of these Murano glass candies. They're in there very precariously, but Mark found me a Liberace record. He went to go get it. He asked me if I had it, and I do not. Oh, looky here. We've got little glass flowers. One's three. Well, let's see it. <gasps> there it is. The Magic Pianos of Liberace. I like that um, cover. It's pretty. Thank you, Mark. All right. Let's see what else we can find. These are right. You put your, your milk your milk container in this and it gives you a handy handle for your milk. $12.50. I did take some of the things that we already um, had put in our car up to the front and she is getting those ready. Here's another Epern. Not as fantastic as that green one that we saw. But for us like $2.50. $42.50 because it's milk glass. It doesn't have that lovely color. Ooh. I saw, well, I think it's on the other side. But I was going to check out this side first. But I saw a milk glass swung vase. Hobnail Vinton. Which is great for spring. How much do they want? 29 Not bad. Memory lane time. I had this Barbie's 1982. This is the, like, this is where the worker works. Here's the front. It would have had a sign up here, but then it had this table that pulled out. It's missing one of the seats. And then it has, this is where you return your trays. Look, there's the menu up there. And then you return your tray here and it has the trash can there. But look, this is what brought me back. It's like, I remember, you know, and you had all these Barbie accessories and you dump out all your Barbie accessories. But here we have the napkin holder. Here's a tray. There's one of the burgers there, the fries. The Big Mac, chocolate shake, and vanilla shake, container. and the styrofoam container, yeah. Oh my gosh, they want $20 for it, but I mean, memories. Memories, I gotta put it back down on the floor, but I just, I just saw it, and then like, instantly, I had it. Well, look at all of the salt and pepper shakers. <sighs> Could we be so lucky for them to be, like, prices that we can get? Let's see, how much are these bunnies? $9.95, possibly. These are $22, so the anthropomorphic, they know that they like their anthropomorphics too. So like the little corns are 12 I have those little guys. I have so many salt, oh my gosh, look at them. I have so many salt and pepper shakers. See, these are 20 You're going to have a hard time finding anything anthropomorphic for under $20 sometimes. Because, you know, it's charming. Well, those turtles are... Mm. They're having a good time there. They are. Let's see what else. Ooh, we got some head faces over here, though. Oh, my goodness. Look at this big pig. He's 24. He's wearing glasses. Why do I want him? He's chalkware. Mark will be like, no. Where's he at? I'll have to ask Mark. Mark, can I have this pig? I like him. I think he'd be great. He's fun. He's got glasses. I don't really, look, that pig's having a little binky. I don't really, I mean, I'm not like a pig. Mark, can we take him home? He's $29. <laughs> Why? He's so, don't you think he's neat? He's got glasses. He could sit on the floor. He's reading his little book. I don't care. 
I mean, don't you think he's he's 24? This booth isn't having a sale, is it? You know, he's fun. I like him. I don't like this pig, but I like that one. He's kitschy. He's fun. He's reading a little book. I think he's got, oh, I think he's got damage on his hoof, which doesn't bother me. Because, I mean, I'm not going to resell him because he's big. I don't want to ship him. Get him down. Yeah. Here, I'll move this guy. Do you do you kind of like do you kind of like him? Not really. No. <laughs> well, but you know what? You you deal with it, don't you? Yes. Oddly heavy on the bottom. He's a bank. He's a smasher. No one smashed him, thank goodness. Well, or you flip him upside down and shake him to death till you get your money out. I like him. That is what is called having a happy marriage. It's so, I mean, don't you think he's cute? Kind of. No. I know he's got that repair on his hoof. I really, you I'm need to, you, you need to find something for you now. Okay. He's been looking at Hot Wheels, but now we have to replace something. Here, what can we put to replace? Don't worry about it. Well, I know, but that's a big hole there that's going to bother me. But anyway, okay, let's look at these head bases. Let's just see. 44. Hmm. I like these. These are the ones that I like. The little ones, 24. She is Napco. But she's got a broken eyelash. So we're not going to get any of those. But I'm so happy. Mark, you just made my hat, my, my happy little day. Here, ooh, this is beautiful for $7.95. This Bohemian um, cut to clear glass. I'm not going to get it, but I'm just saying it's, it's a great price. I don't like the Fenton shoes. It's not my jam. Pigs. Chalk wear pigs wearing glasses. Yes. <laughs> so happy. So happy. Here is a little pelican bank. I like the color of its beak, of course. He's made in Japan. He's $8.99. So, I don't know. I think he's cute. I'm going to get him. All right, so Mark and I, Mark and I are having discussion about the Mexican pottery pieces, and I, I tend to just buy the glazed ones. Those are the ones that I like. This one looks very Ken Edwards, but it's Mexico AS. Um, sometimes Ken Edwards will sign his with like a little critter. Um, I do like this one. It's ten dollars, which isn't a bad price. I'm not going to get it today because I'm really trying to just, just buy the um, Tanala ones or the. The Ken Edwards ones, but I liked the glazed ones more over than like the the pottery looking ones. Well, this is a great piece right here. It's twenty four dollars, which is an amazing price. That's really fun, mid century modern. Oh, look at the banana planter for twelve ninety nine. I think that's fun. But I was looking at this tough guy, Mark. Here's your new coffee mug. Don't mess with him. This is $16.99. It's false graph. Muggsy. Oh, this is Muggsy. Oh, it sure is. Well, that's why it was $16.99, which honestly is not a bad price. I have a Muggsy with the face on it, but look at this hairy chest. This bird right here is telling that other, he's giving that other bird the what for, for sure there. I kind of like this little thing. It's only $5, but I know I probably have people that would like, oh, because it's like a physician's, like a little medicine box. I'm not going to get it, but I thought it was neat to show. Oh, God bless our camper. I have a plate just like this that I need to sell, but I love them. My grandma and grandpa had a cab on their truck just like that, and I always thought it was the neatest thing. And the bed was up there. $12.99. All right, first of all, look at this handsome fella. Oh my gosh, he's so handsome. Thank you for your service, sir. I don't know who you are, but thank you for your service. But look at this. This is vintage. It's Mark Japan on the bottom, patent pending, but it's this peacock sculpture. So I'm definitely gonna get this. I've got a lot of peacock, people who like their peacocks. I've gotten a couple peacock things. It's been one of the things that I've kind of I guess as you could say, put out in the universe because I'm 
things that I wanted to find or look for. Mark found this picture. It's cute. The Curse of Drink. <laughs> Adorable. Also going to get this little stainless set here. I think it's aluminum, polished aluminum, but it's a cream and sugar set on the under tray. So I think for a coffee bar that would be great. It's twelve dollars, so I'm gonna get that. All right. So the other the other day I found one that wasn't this glaze, um, and I didn't get it. But this guy is, and again, what you do with him is you take off your glasses, and he holds them for you at night, just like that. So. He's six dollars, and I'm gonna I'm gonna get him. I wanted to say too, if you have an antique booth too, it's such a good idea if you have social media following to put a little put a little frame up so people can find you. So I'm gonna go on Instagram and follow Teal Door Collectibles, and uh, yeah, that's a great idea. All right, we're gonna get you, doggy. Oh, for five dollars. Oh, for five dollars, yeah. He's got a little chippy right on the edge of his boot but oh i found several of these little goober little, little bugs they're like little um crickets or whatever but we're gonna get him for five dollars look at this little guy up here oh my gosh look at him he's 12 but he's a baby he's got his little diaper on with his golf clubs and look the little bird has the golf ball that's adorable i can't really do 12 dollars on it but it's different that's that's what I like about it. Spooning for you in Kentucky. This googly eye. I like this Florida mug. It is um, Sun Glow, Miami, Florida, Japan. How much are you? You've got little porpoises on you. You are six dollars. Oh, you got a boober on you though. E. I think these are. $15 as is. Oh, yeah, the big one. I think it's just the big one that has the big chip in it. Let's see. Where's my where's my light? Do you glow? I bet they do. Oh, wrong way, Misty. No, you do, they do not. Boy, I really thought for sure that they did. They do not. We're going to put them back. If they did, if they did have a uranium glass, I might think about it. There's a little butter butter bell dish you will glow in your twenty dollars i'm not even going to test you i'm not going to get my thing out of my pocket again because i already know that you glow because i've sold you several times oh look at this i love these look here we go he's asleep now he's awake he's asleep he's awake he's ten dollars i don't know what that is going on in there but he's got those Oh, those reticulating eyes. <laughs> I can never say it right. I think this is Washerbach. Yeah. Wow, Washerbach. I can never say that word either. But I like their pottery. Well, we had a great time at the Vet City Antique Mall. I caught that pig. It was so fun. It, it, it's just, it's, it's fun going to places that you've never been to before. Um, it's kind of, it's fun. It's an adventure, but you kind of still kind of miss the places that you normally go to every day because you kind of know where to look. So it takes you a little bit longer to go into a place that you've never been in before because you don't quite know your boundaries or, you know, where to look at yet. But if you're down in the Bowling Green area, make sure that you do step in and stop in. Make sure that you stop into Vet City Antique Mall. It's a great place. Lots of interesting things. Everything that I showed you in the video, I did pick up and buy. If you're interested in anything, all you have to do is send me an email, thriftorjunkervintagehunter at gmail.com, and I'll let you know if it's available now or if it's going to be available in an upcoming live sale. I have live sales every Tuesday and Wednesday at 1 o'clock Eastern Standard Time right here on my YouTube channel, so I hope that you can attend. And as always, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one we need. Red hot mama, some charmer, yes, indeed. They say that I should be in the follies, hot tamales. They say that I got a pair of eyes just like old Sven Valleys. I confess that I possess the sweetest charms in town. And unless I miss my guess, the boys will follow me around. I could make a music master, drop his fiddle, make a bald head, a man part his hair.